Hello children, in today's assignment you will need the little explorer and capital letters book. Are you all ready? Wow, in the capital letters book what do we see here? We see a busy road. What is this? A busy road. What do you usually see on a busy road? You see many vehicles. You see many vehicles like a truck, a bicycle, a car, auto and bikes. Isn't it? And then there's a little girl who is crossing the road on zebra crossing. What do you mean by zebra crossing? If you have observed the road, you will have black and white stripes on the road where the traffic signal is. Isn't it? This is called as zebra crossing. When you are crossing the main road, you should always walk on the zebra crossing. And what do we have here? It's a traffic light. What is this children? Traffic light. And in the traffic light, there will always be three colors, three lights. And the lights keep changing. Can you tell me which colors are they? Yes, they are red, yellow and green. Red, yellow and green. Red means stop. Red means all the vehicles have to stop. And when the yellow light comes, they have to wait. What should they do? They have to wait and get ready. Okay. And when the green light comes, they can go. When the green light comes, it says go. Okay children, remember red means stop, yellow means wait, green means go. Now you are going to trace these circles in the clockwise direction. Clockwise means you will move the hand in this way. In the previous page you moved the hand in this anti-clockwise. Now you will move the hand towards this red arrow like this. Make a circle and come back and join. Start like this. Make a circle, come back and join. Okay. And see all the wheels here, they are also in round shape, circle shape. You need to trace all this and then you can color them. You can color the vehicles in whichever color you want. But the traffic lights, which color will it be? The one on top is red, yellow and green. Okay, once you finish this, you will go to the next page. And then trace the circles. Like this slowly join the dots. Parents once they finish these two lines. You can put dots even for these. And then let them practice. You know put dots like this and let them draw on this. If you feel they need more practice. They can draw on the same circle two, three times like this. So you don't have to write and give it to them. They can practice on the same circle like this. Okay children, then you will complete this page and send it to us. Thank you. Bye-bye.